Right then, today I'm going to show you how to make a, uh, a wasted shape. Another one of the basic shapes. This is going to be a pot that's wider at the bottom, narrow in the middle, wider at the top. Probably about this tall. I've already sent it away, so I'll just get straight on with it. So open it up, find the centre, in you go. Pull your fingers to one side, same as always. Compact the base. Always make sure that you compact the base. It'll just say we're cracking. You don't really want to make a pot and when it's drying out the thing cracks. Very disappointing. Right, so that's the base compacted. So now the first pull, I'm just going to bring it up, even the sides of the pot up. I'm not trying to make it too tall. Just trying to get it an even thickness all the way up. Right, the next pull, I'm going to knuckle this up, give it a little bit more height. Right to the top, keep the top nice and even. Got a bit of clay away. I'm going to make this pot wasted. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use a colouring technique. And this technique involves using the index fingers, the thumbs, these three fingers took away, and you use the pads of your middle finger. So that is the so the finger positions that you want. So what I'm going to do, watch what happens around the bottom of the pot, I'm going to grab the clay, I'm going to start bringing the clay in, and wasting it off, and then I'm going to relax it as I get close to the top. See that's already put a bit of a waste into the pot, which is what I'm after. Right, now we can use the throwing rib. This is the throwing rib, got a straight profile on it, perfect for truing up the sides of pots. Come in, I'm going to present the tool to the pot, I'm going to grab the clay and we're going to start wasting this pot off. And I was always taught at college when I was doing the basic shapes to exaggerate as much as I could. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to give it as narrow waste and bring this out. When I mean exaggerate, we used to try and make us take it to the point of destruction. So you sort of get to the point where it was just about to collapse. And then you try and rescue it. Some didn't collapse, some did. And you can see I'm slowly working this wasted shape into this pot. Nice and steady. Quite a good technique to learn this. It's good for making teapot spouts. is always a favourite with this because your teapot spout is really a wasted smaller pot. It's good for finishing off the top of vases. It's just a good technique to learn. Wasting is a good technique to learn. There are lots of different uses. You can turn these into goblets if you want. You can just leave them as a, as a small vase if you want. You can do entirely what you want with these things. So that's a wasted shape. Try it, it's quite nice. Just remember that colouring. When you do the colouring, the finger positions of these two fingers, the thumb, the pads of your middle fingers, and that's the colouring technique. So I'll leave it at that. Try it, see how you get on with it. What nice pots to make. Another one of your basic shapes. Thank you very much.